All right, I'm making this quick video on this Cobalt 257 piece mechanics tool set. And we are just gonna open it up and just see what's going on inside. So this thing is pretty heavy. Surprised how heavy it was, even though I shouldn't have been surprised. So on the box, it does say that it has SAE and then metric. And you have a lifetime guarantee. So this is what you're welcomed to. You have the two trays here on the bottom that open up and then the two little latches here to open up the top area. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this off first. But I'm gonna go ahead and open the little metal latches here. So when you open it up, you're greeted with all this stuff on the top of the box here. And we have all the little bits right there. I'm gonna get a close up on and you can pause the video and see, uh, just see the bits. And then we have the wrench tools up here. And then we see we have like the like raised up etching or whatnot to tell you what size it is. And then we got some more, I believe speciality tools right here because so I did try to separate one of these, but I don't think they're supposed to be separated. So, uh, but that's what I said, uh, speciality, because I'm not really sure. I've never really had a tool like that before, but it seems like it'll come in handy. All right, so I had trouble removing this. I had to pry it away, but that's what that looks like. Yeah, so I have a random bit on there and the magnetic action seems to work pretty good. I believe these two actually fell from the top. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put these back. You also get a cobalt sticker or decal. All right, so can lift up this little mat right here, which is just like foam. Get that out of the way for now. And you have your Allen keys, I believe they're called, hex keys. And you can take a look at all that. You have your half inch, your three eighths, and then your quarter drive. You have the extension, an extension for the quarter inch, an extension for the three eighths. And that's all looking pretty good and then you have these right here for your little handheld whatever you want to use that for and it looks like that's about it all right so now that we've gone over that i'm going to go ahead and just close it i don't want to get into super detail i kind of just want to share these metal latches are pretty cool they're not super stiff or anything it seems like i'm never i'm not going to have trouble with that which is awesome and this is the first or the top drawer and let's go ahead and try to remove this real quick. So it took a tad bit of force to remove it, but I ended up removing it. And here you have all your little tools for the ratchet. And I'm just gonna go hover over them real quick, just so you can see. So that is the top drawer. I'm gonna go ahead and put it back and take out the second or the final drawer down there all right here's the second drawer or the final drawer and we see they have a little security tag right here on there and so i take that off so i can take the little reading for that tool but i'm going to hover over this one as well if you want to pause the video and take a look at what sizes you're getting And we have these longer ones, which is really nice. So these longer ones actually only work for the quarter inch wrench. I just tested it out real quick, just to be sure. But that's that. It's got these cool little handles on the side. It's all just one piece. You can stick your fingers in there and carry it like that if you choose to. Right there on the other side. Here you get a look at the back. And here's the bottom surface if you want to look at that. And that's pretty much it for this video. I just wanted to share my purchase and go over all the little tools that this uh, mechanic tool set came with. And that's about it. If you like the video, like the video. If you like my content, subscribe to the channel. And feel free to turn on the notification bell and have all clicked for notifications if you want to receive uh, updates when I upload and stuff like that. Uh, feel free to check out my SoundCloud and Spotify playlist in the description below. 
And that'll pretty much do it for the video, guys. Thank you for tuning in, and I will see you in the next video.